I like solving this problem just by brute force. What I'm going to do is draw my box containing six white balls and four red balls. And we're interested in finding what the probability of getting a red ball on the second draw, given that we've drawn a white one on the first draw. So let's suppose we do draw that white ball. We'll call it W1 for the white ball on the first draw. Then what, is our, what, what does our box look like now? Well, now we have a box. Since one white ball has been removed, we have five white balls left and four red balls. And if we've drawn a red ball on the second draw, we can find the probability of getting a red ball on the second draw given that we've drawn a white ball on the first draw. Well, if we think of this, let me get a different color here. If we think of this quantity here, this box here, as our new sample space, we have uh, four red balls left out of the total nine that are in the box, or probability is just four ninths.